If you have ChatGPT and you're wondering where in the heck are the plugins, even I was confused. So I'm going to show you where to find the plugins, even if you should have the plugins because you are a plus user. Here's ChatGPT. Now, if you're a plus user, you will have access to ChatGPT4. Now, you see, I have a plugin. I put Canva's plug in there. However, it didn't show up right away. I had no access. So what you want to do is go to your settings, go to settings and beta, and you will then click beta features and then just, oh my gosh, tongue twister, and then turn on the plugins. I went ahead and put on the advanced data analysis as well. That's it. And then after you do it, Refresh your screen, go to ChatGPT, go to plugins, go to the download, then go to the plugin store and search whatever plugin you want. Now I'm going to add chat with PDF because I want that one. Of course, it wants me to log in with Google and I'm good with that. So let's go for it. And I think you can have up to three. So play with it, but here's the thing, you can add them and you can remove them and then bring them back. So you're not just limited to three, but just three at a time. Play with this. I hope this helps. Make sure you come back because I will be doing some tutorials on how to use your plugins on ChatGPT and come back often to hear more about what's going on in ChatGPT or whatever else there is in education as a principal or as an educator, make sure that you subscribe, comment, tell me how you're using ChatGPT and make sure you like this video and share it often.